Today we have a setup from the other day on the 20M time frame. We have a slider top. We break here. The trend is down. The other time frames are not clear. Now, on the two hour time frame, we have a typical with bottom here okay 4481 meaning the trend is up we break that the trend will be down however however look at the other time frames okay we have a bottom fractal here one two three four five around 4482 all right now if we remain around the level here, the trend will be up. So the three hour time frame would confirm the two hour time frame, meaning we go up. We have to wait for a resolution on this particular time frame. Now, if we continue to go down, uh, we'll have a bottom reversal on the two hour time frame. So today we're looking at the two hour time frame and three hour time frame. Again, you have to look at all the other time frames. If nothing else is appearing. Uh, we can just ignore them for the time being. And then we have the open and we'll find out if the two time frames will complement one another and if they're both in alignment we have a bottom here and a bottom here we break again the two hour it's bottom reversal going down now we have the spikes to uh, contend with on the open you have to be careful about that all right so uh that's the setup right now and in the meantime, again, keep looking at the other time frames. Now, we have one here, too. Okay. This is indicating a bottom here. Now, if we don't uh, hold here, it'll go down, meaning it will influence the two-hour time frame to go down and then the three-hour time frame to go down. All right. So right now, actually, we have uh, three bullish uh, fractals, growth fractals, uh, pointing up. Uh, the 30-minute time frame, maybe, but we'll, uh, we'll concentrate on these time frames right here, okay? Pointing up, pointing up, pointing up, unless we have a reversal. And uh, you have to give yourself uh, a little room in case it does uh, reverse, uh, reverse down. And that's the setup for tonight. So your uh, dominant time frames would be one hour, two hour, three hour. Again, if we hold here, turn this up. If we hold here, the trend is up. If we hold here, the trend is up. If we break the two hour time frame, the trend is down. Then you can enter a trade going down. Uh, on a stop, you can put the stop right here, um, 89. You can put a stop here, around 88. So, this one here, you have to watch out for the spikes. Uh, it may fool you. So uh, keep your eye today on the one hour, two hour, three hour time frame. Uh, if all these hold, uh, we're going to have a bounce up here in the morning. Uh, on the open, uh, tough to do a trade. I would wait uh, until after uh, 8.30. Um, yesterday, uh, spikes were really out of hand. But right now, it looks uh, pretty bullish here. 
until we break the levels here of 144.81. Okay, again, uh, we have bottom reversals, and then the market will go down. We'll have to wait and see what happens there. And Kordinicki is signing off.